Greetings Hype Knees, my name is Hyper Himes, and welcome to I Miss You. Now, this is a point-and-click horror game, and not only that, you are going to see some real, really, really large similarities to another horror game that we played in the past. And I feel like the more that we get into it, the more that you are going to see similarities. But, it's still a horror game, I may as well play it for you, and... Pretty loud. <laughs> yeah, whatever. The game is at 14% volume because it tends to be loud for stuff like that, but jump straight in. For 100% gameplay, please use headphones. I'm using earphones, so I guess that counts, so let's go. By the way, is that Comic Sans font? Oh, I feel like I shouldn't be taking this game seriously already, but hey, I'm not judging. Okay, I miss you. Oh, this has a story. 1996, March 22nd in Texas. United States of America. A young lady named Maya found hanged in her house. You mean hung? Uh, in her hung in her house. The young lady have committed suicide after two days from her husband' death in a car accident. Well, I am. Don't know what's with the abrupt sound right there, but first of all, I am noting a lot of spelling errors. <laughs> Uh, anyway, the young couple have been married since two months, and they were happy as people said. Until this time, people say they hear screams and laughs coming from the house, but nobody dare to go there. Most of people hear a young voice with the words, I miss you. Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you 100% right now. I said I wouldn't judge the thing, but like, you know, you ever heard of spell check? Like, at the very least... Like, seriously, just throw your words in, like, I don't know, Google Doc. Even Google Docs can literally do that for you, and that thing's free. But you know what? I'm still gonna he hear this game out. Like, the story is pretty interesting. Not even a capital M. But, uh, actually, since it's a point-and-click game, I should show my mouse cursor right now. I'm not sure if you can see it right now, but I just activated it. So, here's next. Enter. Ooh, straight into the window. <laughs> oh, I'm already interested. What is, okay, living room. Well, the ambience, I'll admit, is definitely creepy. Bring back the dead. Nice. What is that? I can't believe it. He is dead. How could he leave me like this? Oh, look at that. Oonsie, 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 oonsie. Boogity boo. Look at them. It's a happy couple. Oh. Ghost. Do I do it again? Oh, 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 running child. Running child. He's running to the left. Or run. he ran from the left to the right. Can I interact with anything else? By the way, wait, wait, wait. Do you see that? That one in front of there. Uh oh. Hello? <laughs> okay, that was a plumbing cheapo scream. Come on. Oh wait, are there words on the wall now? Feels like oh, I can leave through the door. What if I just stay in here? That's a plumbing cheap scream. I tell you, I'm. I don't think I can read those words. I don't even think they are words. But I guess we enter the next room. Now bathroom. But why is bathroom uppercase? Okay, M maybe I'll explain what this game is trying to copy if it hasn't been obvious yet of what it's trying to do. But anyway, wh what are our options? Because I actually can't click anything. Uh, hello? Oh, toilet! Oh, I see why you. I played that game before. It's pretty cool. Good pixelated horror game. Thanks. Good job for reminding me. A sink? Anything else? Maybe there's like a third thing I can interact with? I can't interact with that bathtub, I don't think. You know what? You know what? I, I'll, I'll give it to them. The fact that the music that was like really just really building up to something and it just abruptly just stopping that kind of got me 
Oh! What a beautiful lady you look like. Hopefully you look like a lady. Can I flood your sink? Can we do... I thought that was blood coming again, but nah. I mean, the only thing I can really do is tamper with your sink, madam. I mean, yeah, there's that, but like... Oh, I, I didn't even see that right there! That was literally right this right here. You can't... I'm not sure if you can see it. Hopefully my mouse is existent. But that is straight up camouflaged. I see you. Uh, the toilet kind of beat you to the punch already on that one, ma'am. As I see, as I click here again, it doesn't do anything. I'm tampering with your sink, guys. You guys don't like running water? Actually, I know it seems kind of biased. And like, you know, I'm trying to be too philosophical ghostbuster around here. But honest question, how is there still running water in this place if like, I'm supposed to be a ghost inspector here? Or something like that. In fact, why am I even investigating this place in the first place? Oh, whoa, 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 the lights, the lights. Ladies and gentlemen, the lights are flickering. Along with that note, hopefully this doesn't hurt your eyes. Straight in the beer. Wait, why am I in the bedroom now? But it's just okay, first of all, why is why was living room lowercase? But bathroom and bedroom are both like all uppercase. Okay, I gotta find out what to observe in this room. Maybe the pillows, bed. Oh! Well, I thought I heard a light switch somewhere. All right. I, I'm sorry, I meant my heartbeat. I'm sometimes a doof. There's gotta be something else I can interact with. I mean, what about the book? Can I just leave? I mean, when a ghost, when the pic, when not only a picture frame, but a mirror screams at you, you think it'd be a good time to leave. Uh-oh. Ladies and gentlemen, the light switch is now broken. Guys? Can I leave? Hello? Help. What am I supposed to do? Alright. Oh, okay! <laughs> sure. Alright. <laughs> just a jump scare for an ending. Why not? Just Let's just slap it right on there. Boom! Just mm, mwah, beautiful. Okay, I guess that was the game. That was I miss you. Uh, if I had webcam on right now, honestly, okay. Here's the things that the game did wrong. For, no, no, no. First of all, let me just preface this: this game copied the house. No joke, and may, I'm not sure maybe there's a chance I haven't done that much, you know, digging deep into it, but if you could compare it to anything, you could compare it to The House, The House 2, The Halloween. Those types of games were amazing, and here's the thing about this game. While this game did have ambience, it lacked any form of tension. The grammar was definitely not on par, when it could be easily fixed with something like, I don't know, Google Docs, anything, Google Translate could even fix that thing, and I guarantee you it could. Maybe, or at least it would tell you the spelling, or the spelling errors that you could do. And also, just the words, and also for some reason the clock is still going in the background, and just the abrupt jump scares with like the classic house formula, just tap on a bunch of things. But the thing about the house is that that actually had ambience. And I'm not saying that the other game didn't ha like, you know, this game didn't have ambience, but like... All, of, all it led to was, like, some forced jump scare, which, yeah, the house does do that, but, like, it wasn't even satisfying. And, like, they changed it up. Because every single time it was a jump scare in this game, it was a plebbing, stupid pop-up screamer. And, yeah, I can understand Halloween, House 2, and House 1 did that, but sometimes they changed it up. Like, I remember, like, uh, if I could explain it, but I feel like I'm dragging all in. Oh, I need a drink. But guess what? I know it seems like I'm dragging this out for a long time, but I need to inform you, there's a sequel. There is an I Miss You 2. I'm not sure if there's an I Miss You 3, but just be known. I feel like they were trying to copy the house, which is why they made a second game. At least I think it's trying to copy the house. This is made by RX Games, by the way. 
So you know what? That was I Miss You. Definitely needs improvement. Let's hope I Miss You too is a lot better, hopefully. But for now, if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to leave a like on the video and also share it with your friends for more horror game content. And if you enjoy my content in general, why not subscribe to my YouTube channel? And if you haven't yet or you're looking forward to, please be sure to hit the bell icon next to the subscribe button to receive all my notifications on this YouTube channel in the near future. But above all else, I will see you, entities and guardians, in the next video. Hail the hype news.